Now this system is about the laundry tray. How to activate this laundry tray is to block the IR sensor using a hand and then the tray will come out. And then uh, let's say when it detect rain and now uh, I will uh, get some water and put it on a rain sensor and let's see what happened. Okay, let's simulate it and you'll see that the tray has been retracted and then uh, an SMS will be sent to my phone and alert uh, the user. And an uh, SMS is coming in and there you go, uh, it's raining and laundry has been retracted. I will be doing the security subsystem for our project. So um, in this project, I will have a transmitter on one side, which is connected to my laptop, and I will send commands wirelessly on this uh, Terra term to control things in the house. So to power up, what happen is so to arm the house, I will press number uh, press A. So when I press A, house up. And in this house, I'll have a motion sensor inside here. That will activate in a few seconds. Okay, so when motion is detected, there will be a sound. SMS will come in. Yeah, SMS is very safe. And to disarm the house, I just need to press the button on my keyboard. Disarming house. Another function that I can do also is to control the door wirelessly. So let's time to open the door, I'll press. The door will be open. Yeah. And to close the door, I just need to press C for close. The door will be closed. Just like that. Yeah, that's all for the security subsystem. So basically, for this subsystem, it's a climate control subsystem. And next, we'll have to trigger the switch to turn on and off the system. First, it will turn on the fan, but currently, because the temperature is low enough, the fan is not triggered. If the fan is at a higher speed, it will be triggered. Next is the light. Now the light is turned on because the brightness is deemed to be dark, uh, too dark. Next, uh, when the light is brighter, the light will turn off and the motor will rise. And after the light is, after the brightness is deemed to be uh, dark enough, it will retract the motor again and pull back the window light. Next uh, is the solenoid system which uh, would we detect if there's uh, as far as that research we would detect a person uh, if it's sitting on a sofa which is represented using the IR sensor so if there's that some, someone is detected it will turn on the music system and the speaker will play the music next after if there's nobody at the seat after 10 seconds so basically this system is about the uh, automated pet food dispenser and uh, let's take a look. For instance, if let's say the pet has finished the food and uh, I'll change the uh, container at the bottom to the empty, empty tray to simulate the empty, uh, empty food tray. Okay, and then let's see what happens. Okay, the system controls the motor to allow dispensing to be uh, proceed and then uh, the food will automatically uh, being uh, dispensed and then okay for example if let's say the food is uh, full uh, top up to the max okay the, uh, if this system will closer use the motor to closer uh, dispensing uh, the dispenser okay and then uh, uh, you send an sms to actually alert the user that uh, the pet has been top up 